If I was to watch you fall again, I would be a parachute. There's no need to lie or to pretend. You got me and I got you. So don't fall without me. Don't fall. the best advice probably to be true to myself being honest with myself and with other people about who I am and the relationships that I have really just to um, communicate she always made it very easy for me to confide in her don't forget where you've come from you know, be like everybody else really tell me what you want I'll give you what you need so much easier if you were fighting with going with your instincts and doing what you feel is right in any particular situation at the time. A mother of the year should be real. So being a, a role model, not just, not just at home, but extending that love out there. Very loving, very down to earth person and can take on any challenges, kind of like my mom. Be alive. <laughs> she has been a pillar of support when my when the waves have come crashing around me and the storms and fires. She's just she's been that pillar. I wouldn't have such a strong sense of self. I know, it'd be a part of me is missing. To love others unconditionally. My mum actually taught me to ride through the storms. Be down to earth, be yourself and you know, treat people the way you would like to be treated. Not really because she didn't teach me anything. She taught you how to make Yorkshire puddings. <laughs> they share a bond with a child like nobody else. You know, someone to uplift you. Mum makes everything okay. Love to me has no boundaries. Without that, it's just an empty shell. Not being judgmental. Nobody's perfect and you accept the imperfections and you love somebody anyway. Yes, yeah, same. <laughs> <laughs> I like that answer. I thought it was really good. Nominate your mum today for Bernardo's Australia's Mother of the Year Award. Know a great mum? Go to motheroftheyear.org.au or visit our Facebook page and nominate her for Bernardo's Australia's Mother of the Year Award. Ooh, I will be your parachute.